a horse owner should call a vet for lameness when it becomes apparent that there's a, uh, an impairment in the gait or there is a swelling in the limbs or the body that's associated with it. And it is important in those sense to know a myriad of things. Did this horse hit himself? Bang it on something? Did he slip and strain it? Has he got an infection that's going up the leg? Has he uh, a suspensory or a tendon given out and caused the swelling? Uh, so if you know these things, for instance, you know he hit it, <laughs> then, and there's no external lesion, no skin lesion or anything like that, then nine times out of 10, you, you really just treat that yourself and carry on. Uh, if there's a skin lesion uh, and this sort of thing, well, then you can consider having somebody look at it. Uh, if you're concerned at all about soft tissue injury in terms of tendons or suspensories, then you should have somebody look at it. Um, if, if he's fallen and that sort of thing, and he is, there's lameness associated with the swelling, then you should have somebody look at it because he could have injured himself. Uh, but there, there, as I said, there are a number of causes that, that, can, cut, that can result in you know, the leg being swollen. And it, I guess it's up to the owner to define to themselves whether it's trivial or whether they think that somebody should look at it.